You won the debate. That's what America is about. Robust okay, debate. Don't walk away from it. Let's all right? talk about something more important. Bill O'Reilly pulls out all the stops trying to convince important. Donald Trump Let's to show up for Thursday important. night's GOP debate. Okay. They went toe to toe with neither backing down. You know, it's called an eye for an eye, I guess, also. You can look at it that way. No, no, no. You, 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 that's I don't Old take Testament. It seriously. Bill, no, 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 no. You are taking if it. You're the Christian. The eye hey, for the Bill. eye goes out. Here's, here's what it is. Turn in the Bill, other Bill, let me tell you, you're taking this right much here. more seriously than I am. Trump and O'Reilly have been friends for 35 years, and the Fox News host got personal. I bought you so many vanilla milkshakes you owe me. Will That's you true. just consider, I want you to consider, all right? Think about it. Say, look, I might come back. Forgive, go forward, answer the questions, look out for the folks. Just want you to consider it. You owe me milkshakes, I'll take them off the right. ledger if you consider it. Well, even though you and I had an agreement that you wouldn't ask me that, which we did, uh, I will therefore forget that you asked me that. Social media went crazy using the hashtag Trump milkshake. Here's the visual I have. One milkshake, two straws. Oh, oh O'Reilly sure? and Trump. <laughs> so where does Donald Trump's love of milkshakes come from? We are at the home of New York City's latest craze, the $15 milkshake that is simply to die for. Now get this, the milkshake's creator used to be Donald Trump's personal chef. He loves milkshakes. He loves ice cream. You know, he's like, he's American. He's Americana. That's what these milkshakes are. Chef Joe Isidori went to work for Trump right out of culinary school. He later oversaw food preparation for all of Trump's properties. Now Isidori owns his own place, Black Tap, where folks line up around the block for his milkshake creations. I worked for Donald for a long time, and I can tell you, milkshake or not, his favorite flavor is cherry vanilla. Despite O'Reilly's milkshake appeal, Trump is standing firm about boycotting the debate because of his ongoing feud with moderator Megyn Kelly. He even retweeted these photos of Kelly with the caption, criticizes Trump for objectifying women, poses like this in GQ magazine. I have zero respect for Megyn Kelly. I don't think she's very good at what she does. I think she's highly overrated. When the debate begins at 9 p.m. in Des Moines, Trump will be two miles away at a fundraiser for wounded veterans. He tweeted, the debate tonight will be a total disaster. Low ratings with advertisers and advertising rates dropping like a rock. I hate to see this. Political pundits are weighing in on whether Trump's decision will help or hurt his campaign. Everybody that opposes Donald thinks it was a bad idea. Everybody that supports Donald thinks it was a good idea. And this is the highest stakes war he has started, and I'm not sure it's when he's going to win in the end. But if milkshakes don't change Donald Trump's mind, nothing will. You owe me your 17 milkshakes, then, and I want them. That's okay. Oh, my gosh, that is so good.